Hello, I am Fravatar, and welcome back to this Let's Play Diablo 3 Blind and Hardcore, where we're now in Act 4, and um, I'm changing my tactics a little bit. I'm going to try out this uh, Wave of Light, Explosive Light Rune. Um, Breath of Heavens is back on the lineup uh, with uh, an increase to my attack, 15%, Death and torture for 45 with seconds. End. And seeing these heavens fall. And uh, the rest is the same. I'm, I switched to Mantra of Evasion because I want the extra dodginess. And it's now spec so that it shields me if I go below 25% life. A little bit of, uh, hopefully, if it works as, as advertised, a little bit of. Uh, Diablo insurance. will corrupt the crystal arch high atop the silver spire. I must stop him, or heaven will be lost forever. This is our last hope. Tyriel and I will ascend the spire and face the Lord of Terror, no matter what stands in our way. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. The corruption is thicker here. How does it feel, knowing you helped me become the prime evil? For all your mighty deeds, all you really accomplished was unleashing me upon the world. Some savior you are, Nephilim. Leah, no! Not enough spirit. doesn't last as long as I try to Oh? Okay. Diablo is climbing the spire. I lived only to serve my master Belion. But you killed him and unleashed the prime evil on the world. An illusion! will no longer hold your spirits, angels. Trying to... The gods strike through me! Yep. Let us cleanse it from this. Ah! 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 Ah!
mighty foe has fallen. Let's see the shield. Intelligence and vitality. Good for a mage. Though I forsook my home, to see it again like this, any joy I might have had is replaced with sorrow. Mm. Upwards, we must make it to the summit. Hmm. That's all about. B7, Intellect Vitality. Another one for the mages. Extra rings would be nice, rings and amulets buff up the top end of uh, my enchanters and myself. I knew Inaris long ago when he was still among the angels. Okay. But he grew weary of battling the demons after a time, and he began to secretly conspire with demons in order to forge a peace. The demoness Lilith became his greatest ally in the Hells, and many other demons and angels joined his cause. After he gained a following, Inaria stole the sacred world stone and used it to create and conceal a world he called Sanctuary. Demons and angels alike fled there, and some of them including Inaris and Lilith. And now, many of these unions resulted in children. They were called the Nephilim. Oh. The children of demons and angels. Well, wow. Interesting. If I understood correctly. Inorius well. was alarmed when he realized that the Nephilim had the potential to surpass both angels and demons in power. I often came to this great span to meditate on things as I looked out over the Silver City. The view used to calm me. Hmm. Skipping over dialogue here. It seems we've both fallen from grace, Tyrion. <laughs> Come, embrace your former lieutenant. Hmm, is it well? Yes, it is it well. A kill of 
Save as many as I can. And there we go, Silver Spire level two. It is not far now. The Angelus Council is no better than the prime evils themselves. We are just pawns in their cruel games. And now you help the worst of them all. Kane would never say that. Yeah, that's right. prepared for this, I think. Gotta try not to do such uh, epic pulls. Thank you for joining us on this episode i hope you enjoyed it and uh, we'll see you on the next one in the meantime take care and bye bye